Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of Spitting Venom, aka The Venom Vlog. And today is just a thank you. This is a Christmas episode, so I want to say Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays to you out there in the world. Uh, Happy New Year to you. Thank you so much for supporting this show. It's it's new to my channel. We just started it like on November 5th, I think. I posted the first episode, and it was like a spur of the moment thing. I was just like, oh, I saw, I, I saw that Tom Hardy started to post this video of him training, and it brought back all these feelings of like, oh, I remember when I was in high school, and Venom, I was reading the Venom comic books in the miniseries, and it got me to go work out because Venom used to work out in the comics all the time and I was just like yeah I was really into that character and then over the years I kind of drifted from him uh, didn't really get too much into Eddie Brock and the character um, and then I even had a friend named Jack who I used to like poke at I was like ah, oh, Eddie he's a huge Venom fan uh, consistently like he did not like me where I went away for a while um, he he is a consistent and hardcore Venom fan and uh, and after that I was like you know I started over the past few years reconnecting probably because of Jack reconnecting with the Venom character and then uh, Dan Slott made the anti-Venom character in the Spider-Man books um, and then we saw Eddie Brock return and then the Flash Thompson stuff that Rick Remender did there was like all this interesting things they were doing with the character that kind of pulled me back in and now Eddie Brock's back in the comics and I've been as you know now that I'm a writer and a storyteller myself been really peeling back the layers on this guy and trying to understand him as a character and the more I peeled back I just kind of saw that I had a lot in common with this guy and and maybe not good things either that I have in common with them um, you know for those who don't know like I'm a brain aneurysm survivor I have headaches all the time um, I it definitely affects my mood I am very moody um, it, it's not easy to you know, keep a composure sometimes especially when you work eight hour days you know by hour four I, I'm, I'm ready to shut down I'm not feeling well um, I, it's it's been it's been a struggle these past uh, few years and that's why I wanted to do the Venom vlog is because it's a character that I think I do identify with on some level he also was uh, suicidal at one point and suicide seems to follow him around in his universe uh, there was that guy in the comics we talked about in Vengeance of Venom who was like a, a, a former like Marine or he was like a, in the military and Venom went to him for advice and gave him money and he's like hey you're homeless go get some food I'll come back and we'll talk again and when he came back the guy overdosed on drugs um, so you had you know suicide come back into Eddie's life at that point and then later on with his wife uh, Anne Weying when they reconnected after being divorced for years um, she became Venom temporarily killed somebody and then living with that guilt hurt her to the point mentally and scarred her mentally to the point where she ended up taking her own life so again this is a constant theme not 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 used all the time but it is something that surrounds eddie brock this idea of death and and um and finding your place you know in the world and when i saw that when i was rediscovering a character i thought that would make for great content for this channel so i'm tying that into my health with the battles i've fought already and thankfully have won I'm getting older now. I'm 35, going to be 36 next year. I'm, I'm getting older. I need to be prepared for the battles to come, you know. And uh, and so I figured, well, let's start losing weight. Let's let's start eating better. Um, let's just get in that. Let's get in shape for for that reason, not to look good or look you know look ripped or anything, but just because uh, we're not. I'm just trying to lose a few pounds uh, before the movie comes out and and keep it off until the movie comes out and that's our goal and thankfully you guys are on board with that and I really appreciate it so every video is not going to have an intro to it where it's me you know talking about weight loss and all that but I'll at least mention it in every video with the little Chiron you know it'll say like you know how much weight I've lost and stuff I'll at least put those in as many videos as I can so that way those out there who do care get to keep up with that as much as the movie news that we're sharing uh, but yeah it's just it's been great with you guys and and seeing the support these episodes have been getting is just amazing and and wants me you know is making me keep going and it's certainly helping me battle other things that I'm dealing with like depression and stuff like that so again thank you all very much for that it, it means a lot and actually one funny thing real quick before I go um I, I did actually well before the funny thing I was buying a couple comics so I do have like Maximum Carnage Spider-Man The Hunger Venom Dark Origin Spider-Man 2099 meets Spider-Man uh, which has Venom in it temp like in a couple pages uh, there's a bunch of stuff I bought on Kindle recently that were on like mega sale so I will do We'll talk about a bunch of Venom comics coming up very, very soon. Thank you guys for watching those episodes as well of the Venom vlog and enjoying those. I hope you are. Uh, but the funny thing was I was going through my closet and I actually found some really cool things. I came across 
Agent Venom and Carnage. Uh, these are toys I probably bought like two years ago, maybe, maybe longer. I can't remember when they came out and they've just been sitting in my closet uh, for this whole time. So uh, I'm, I'm so excited. Like I think we'll make a video on these at some point. Maybe I'll, when I'm talking about Carnage, well, I'll be playing with the Carnage toy and maybe I'll make an episode where we're talking about Agent Venom. Uh, so yeah, I don't anticipate doing like squeezing toy reviews cause I just don't have like money for stuff like that. Uh, but if you guys want me to like squeeze in a toy review or two, like let's see how these go. And then you guys let me know what you think after that. And maybe we'll do more episodes where I go hunt down like a Venom figure and an anti-Venom figure or something like that. And we, we start talking about all the characters and then maybe I can add them to my shelf behind me. And, uh, and then we'll have some Venom stuff in the background for these uh, for future episodes. So, uh, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Again, thank you all for the support. It really means a lot to me. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays to you. Happy New Year. And I'll see you all in the future. Peace.